Game Ranks presents five holy shit gaming moments from January 2015. And just a warning to you guys, there are some very minor spoilers. Nothing crazy, I promise. It wasn't a very big month for game releases, but we still had plenty of surprises. So let's get right into it, starting off with number five. Life is Strange, the episodic story-based adventure game from developers Don't Not Entertainment, centers around Maxine Caulfield. The first episode of the game goes pretty great with some weird writing, but some really interesting family and teenager drama, and then suddenly Maxine discovers that she can reverse time. And the revelation is really freaking cool. Number 4. Dying Light is a pretty decent zombie game. I really enjoyed my time with it until zombie babies showed up. Holy shit. I... Ugh. Oh, it was the worst. I don't I can't even talk about it. Next, let's just move on. Number three. Number three is another dying light moment, and this time it's... Uh, what the... Uh, okay. Alright, that's a little weird. What is that? Number two. Number two is one of the scariest things for me personally, ever. The HD version of the GameCube remake of the original Resident Evil was released on all the major consoles in January and it still retained all the scariness. Most notably, one of the scariest things that used to haunt my dreams and in addition to the GameCube version, Lisa Trevor. God, look at her. Ugh, she's so spooky. Rattling chains and deformed face, it's easily one of the creepiest Resident Evil monsters. It wasn't in the original PlayStation Resident Evil, but it definitely made the GameCube and HD version way scarier. Look at her. Number one. The biggest holy shit moment in gaming from January, like I said, there weren't a lot of games released this month, but when you first encounter one of the giant zombies in Dying Light, you're just doing your thing and then BAM, he busts down a door and fucks you up. They're really big and really scary, and then later on in the game they're pretty commonplace, but anytime you see them, you usually turn the other way. They're heavy, they're slow, they cause a lot of damage, but they're just really creepy looking, and they take a long time to kill. You'll sit there with a metal pipe and whack them over the head 30 times before they fall down. These Dying Light Bastards are big and scary, and that's why they earned the number one spot. So those were our holy shit moments of January 2015. This new series is a great way to start off the new year, but you know what's even better? Liking this video, maybe even subscribing, and most importantly, talking to us down in the comments. What holy shit moments did you experience from January? Let us know down below. And as always, you can visit GameRanks.com for more gaming news and reviews, and thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.